Andy Wilson. Andy Wilson. You getting them down? Uh, he was your he was yeah. your favourite player. Jim, he, was that he, right? he was a good one. He was a he was a good one. Was he? A, was he Bobby a, Skinner was a. He, well, he scored a lot of goals in one season. I think about a record fifty odd goals really? in one season. But he was he was shooting a goal. The money after he shot, he, did, he didn't stop, he kept on moving straight, straight in. ahead. And it was just too bad to the goalkeepers. <laughs> <laughs> the goalkeeper saved the ball, because sure enough, it was with the finish in the net. <laughs> it was either a goal or a hell of a good Unbelievable, eh? <laughs> the year that they, that they got promotion, the last match before that, they played Queen of the South away. Yeah. And the centre half at the so on the train going down, and we talk about Skinner this centre half, and Skinner says, "No, need to worry about him." He says, "I'll get him today." <laughs> sort, sort him out. So halfway through the second half, he got Skinner got him. And it's going to go marching orders. Oh, he got sent off. And as he was walking off, walking off, this lad, he had pulled, came up and said something to him. And he had to get carried off. <laughs> <laughs> he, was, he was also sent at half. He yeah. also oh, he was sent at half. But he had to be carried off. Yeah. <laughs> It's gonna help. That's am that's amazing. You can remember that far back, oh, isn't it? That's, yes. that's great. That's fantastic. Your first away game, the first game in the first division, it was against Greenwich Martin. Oh yeah. Uh -huh. at, at Greenwich, and they got beat. I think it was three nothing. The second game was on a Tuesday night at Ibrox, and they got beat two nothing. The third game on the Saturday, the first home game, and Skinner's his suspension was up. It was mm -hmm. a two game, a two game suspension. Oh, right. He was up, and uh, they won that game. I, I was going to do not like what the score was, but I was feeling it was four three. Yeah. Uh -huh. Yeah. And they went to the end of the season and had to play the, the Hearts at Tynecastle and were fighting to stay in. The, the Hearts scored a goal and Skinner kind of up and got the ball. And instead of going to up the park, he went back to the, to the Lone Pelham goalkeeper yeah. and gave him a dog and say, <laughs> Get up, front the ball down the centre. And he, he says something to the inside right. He kicked off. The inside right and got the ball. Instead of passing it, he kicked it right forward and Skinner after it. Yeah. That, that, the harsh player was not going to be surprised. Uh, he was past the front line and the, the two backs come running, running out to tackle Skinner. Mm -hmm. And Skinner rolled off a one onto the other and maybe it went flat on her ground <laughs> and she's going to run the ball into the net. Yes, yeah, brilliant. <laughs> uh, uh, that, good memory. That was, that was a Skinner. <laughs> yeah, Skinner. Oh, Skinner's here. Big, a bad, badly bad. Front eye. Patterson, Richie, Sutton and Skinner. Patterson, Richie and Skinner. Yes, yeah, Skinner. Is that him there, Jim? Jim? Yes, yeah, Skinner. Uh -huh, can yeah, you see? Yeah. Aye, he was a, a strong player. Cool. Aye. He's not. He's not very big, is he? No, but he's he's quite quite kind of oh, sturdy. Aye. 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 Patterson, let's see. Uh, I was talking about the kind of play there, 
Yeah. 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 Check if you're eligible in less than 60 seconds. That's 1926. Aye. 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 Well, that's the season you're speaking about, uh, James. And just kind of, he scored mm -hmm. 53 goals he scored that season. 63? 53. Oh, 53, 53, 53 goals he scored that season. Which is, uh, he'd, be worth, he'd be worth a pound or two now, wouldn't he? I know. Aye. That's just, there's the story you're, there, there's the very story you've been telling us about Skinner going to play the Harps in Edinburgh Aye. in front of a 20,000 crowd. That's the story you're telling us. Harps scored before the whistle sounded Skinner. It says bust through the Harps defence. That's exactly how you that, told the that's story. Right. That's exactly how you told it. That's right. To score a fine solo goal. Yeah. That's exactly what you've been telling us. Yeah. Have you read this before? He kicked, he kicked the ball off when the was head forward. Yeah. Kicked it forward. And it, that was the only two players that touched the ball. Yeah. Kevin Bees went to re replay, replay it. Doesn't hurt. Airdry, or one of them. It was one of these. Yeah. Uh -huh. And it was a closed game. It worked for me, it works for my clients. It's amazing. I don't know what the score was at the time, but. Skinner got the ball and he oh. That's why my friend. And it's a feminine goalkeeper, a man called Falconer. Mm -hmm. He come out and as he come out, he slipped and went down. A Skinner was running past, yeah. and the goal was up and grabbed him round the knees. <laughs> See? The goalkeeper and the ball and Skinner all he dragged he dragged him into the, <laughs> he dragged him right into the goal. Right into the goal. But the referee had. Blew the whistle and gave them a penalty. Oh, right. Instead of letting it go. Of letting it go, go, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Paul received the penalty. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> You've got a great memory, James. Uh, it's a fantastic. Some things. Uh, to, to, to sit there and reel off all these names. I think it's, uh, ama I think it's well, amazing. I can rattle them. I couldn't do that. No. Oh, I've done stuff like that myself. Good to see you. That's incredible. I think people I was at school with, actually. Yeah. Like that last time I spoke to me, I, yeah, I, 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 was, I was a goalkeeper. Uh, Harry Spence from Love Drum was right back. And a boy called Sharp was left back. He came from Love Drum. The right half was a, a boy called Young. He came from James's Street, right the bottom of Ancrew Street. And uh, William Street uh, and what do you call the centre half? Oh dear, dear. Come, back, got, come back to him. Uh, he stayed in that group I was telling you about. Yeah. Uh -huh. In the left half. That's another one. Oh. <laughs> I know him. Stanley or something. Stanley he was. The outside right was Kerberson, who was, he was, a, he was a better amateur boxer than a football player. <laughs> <laughs> and there was Drummond, played inside. Yeah. Was, the centre, Kilpatrick, Kelly, called him, was the centre forward. Inside left was, oh, and the outside right was a boy called Forbes. <laughs> That's amazing. Good mind, good mind know what they was. Unbelievable. Try and come and get you and the family along. Uh, yeah. And get a bit bite to you at the, at the game. And there's a box where you can just stay inside and watch the game for a box through the through the window. You can uh, watch yeah. the game there. And then we'll bring you back again. Good. So we'll just find an idea that's going to be suitable for you. Okay, and the family to come along and, uh, and do that. And you'll be the guest of the club. And I'm sure... Uh, I'm sure people will come and make a fussy there as well, and you can tell some, uh, you can tell some nice old stories. Uh, yeah. I'm sure there's some people that would love to hear them. Oh. I can make some of it, but uh, <laughs> well, well, I don't think there's many folk to argue with you, to be honest with you. Yeah. So would you like that? Would you like that to go along to the football? Would you like mm. that? Oh yes. Aye, aye. Well, it'd be great to see you there.